Thanks to one of my subscribers for pointing this out to me about Android 14 and the Pebble app. If you've accepted your phone's update to Android 14, you may be shocked to find your Pebble app simply gone, like I was when I updated my Pixel 4 XL. Even worse was when I tried to reinstall it, it gave a message that it could not be installed. After some searching, I found now you have to sideload it with ADB commands. So here's how to get it set up. Thanks to a Reddit post I found that explained all the steps. Link is in the description to the original article I used. You will need a Windows PC and a good USB cable. You will also need to enable developer mode and USB debugging on your phone. First, let's get the files set up on your PC. Download the Android SDK platform tools to your PC. The link is in the description. Once you download it, go ahead and open the zip file. Unless you have a third party app, it will open in File Explorer. Drag the platform tools folder to your C drive. Now you should have a folder called Platform Tools in your C drive. Now we need to get a copy of the Pebble app from rebel.io. Link is also in the description. When you get to this page, right click, choose the save link as. Save it to the same folder as the Android Platform Tools in your C drive. You can verify that Pebble app APK is in the folder using File Explorer. Your desktop is now ready. Next is to get your phone ready. On your Android 14 phone, go to Settings and scroll down to About Phone. Scroll down to Build Number and keep tapping it until you enable the developer options. You might have to confirm your credentials. It will say now that you are a developer. Go back one screen and go into System. Scroll down to Developer Options and enter it. Now scroll down a bit to USB Debugging and enable that. Scroll down more and make sure that the default USB configuration is on the File Transfer slash Android Auto setting. Once all those settings are set, your phone is ready. Now hook up your PC to your phone with a good quality USB cable that can handle data transfers. You should get a USB debugging connected notification on your phone. Now on your PC, click the start menu and type in CMD to get the command line prompt app. It will open up to your user folder. You need to switch over to the platform tools folder. So type in CD slash platform tools to get to the Android Platform Tool folder. Now type in ADB space devices. You will have to allow the connection on your phone side. Once that's done, now you can type in the command ADB install bypass low target SDK block and the name of the app pebble-4.3.apk. All these commands will be listed in the description. You can copy and paste that if you need. Give it a few seconds to install. After it's done, your Pebble app is now on your phone. If you need further instructions, you can watch my Pebble to Rebel video starting at the 40 second mark. Link is also in the description. This is where the app install is completed on Android 13. You can follow the instructions on how to set up notifications and enable the permissions and everything else.